It's Saturday morning, I'm not hungover, so we're going to go and export the cans off to China th via Tesco's. Uh, on screen you should be able to see a uh, screenshot of the price of weighing in your cans per tonne, so if you work that out, something along the lines of 75p a kilo. We haven't got a kilo, we've got about three quarters of a kilo in the backyard, uh, and we'll see which one is the more profitable. Okay. Right. You know you come and put the card in, it registers you. We've done it a thousand times before. I don't want to repeat myself, you don't like me doing it, I don't like me doing it. I'm not wearing gloves today because I've obviously washed all these and some of them are full of pistachio nuts. That's my my bad. Yes, I'm incredibly sure of a job interview. You've got to make an effort, don't you kids? Anyway, we've got some slightly different things in here. I do hope you can hear me. We've got some cigar tubes, they're also aluminium. Uh, we've got the crap steelies as well, but you'll see on the review at the end. Uh, it's been a while, but uh, yeah, we've got some actual protection nowadays. From the sun, from the rain, from pigeons, let's say. Pterodactyls. Uh, else. I've not got protection from your bowls, however. Anyway, as soon as we get to something different, I'll give you a yell. Uh, Okay, so this is an aluminium cigar tube. Cigar's gone, sorry kids. Uh, I was going to keep it, but unfortunately I managed to put my fantastic foot on it and break it. So, good brand, I like them. If you want to send me gifts, I'll have some of these. Woohoo! Anyway, in we go, let's see what happens. Oh, yeah. Analyze it. Yeah, go through his aluminium cap. Hello again. These are deodorant cans. Yes, they're women's. I use them because they actually give you more protection. They are better. Women wouldn't put up with crap deodorant like we do and have to carry it around and spray it on all the time. So, why should we? It smells nice. I smell nice. I am attracted to the opposite sex. Blah, 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 blah. Anyway, it's aluminium. Right, last three, so... One, ma ha ha. How can we always end up with that? I don't know. Two, ma ha ha. Because right, we can't be asked, we just can't badge, badge that in. But yeah, it's two cans at one point, but whatever. So we've got 107 cans gone in, two of uh, the dirty, dirty steels. So it's 53 points. Alright, if I press N, which is you there, it always say 15 kilos of CO2 emissions, and we've earned 53 club car points. We'd have had to spend 53 pounds to get that, or if you're filling up at the gas station, or petrol station as we like to call them, that's 106 pounds worth of petrol because you only get one pound for every two pounds spent. So, uh, I have got a wonderful new site, I'll go to it later on, I'll show you, and we'll see, because I've mentioned this before, we had less than a kilo of cans there, as you saw it takes quite a lot of room, but more than a kilo you have to crush them down, you know, to get them in a bag like this. This weighed about three quarters of one kilo, so we'll find out exactly how much you could have weighed them in as scrappy scrappers, how much would have got compared to this. Anyway, end of for now, see you in a bit, bye! So, as I always get into trouble for never finishing these things off properly, after crunching all the numbers and having a look, as you can see on here, it says uh, 750 to 800 of baled or densified, basically crushed and strapped cans. Um, so, as I say, it was 75 to 80p for a kilo of densified and scrapped cans. So, for the two minutes it took me to get 53 pence worth value. For, from Tesco's where I can get food, petrol, blah blah blah, blah. Um, it was a lot simpler and easier for me plus uh, the only can collection place that I'm aware of over on uh, Oldham Road has actually closed down there may be a uh, scrapyard that takes cans but right here right at the moment the only one I know of is Singleton's and I haven't been to the new site yet so we'll have to have a look but um, there you go I think for ease of use Tesco still has it in the bag and yes, just when I was standing, what would the day be without a great big comedy cock? This was finger-paint-hearted right into the concrete underneath me.